Welcome back everyone to another Brian's Diecast Thailand. And today we're working with this. It's a matchbox super fast number 11 made 1972. So that'd be a 73 release. And it's the flying bug. Now, as we can see going around there's lots of paint chipped off everywhere, one of the jet things on the roof's missing, and also the wings. It has like die cast wings on the on the roof too. Quite a funny looking thing, but I think it's worth having a go at what we can do. Let's see what we can do. So let's take it off the turntable and let's have a closer look. So I'll catch you then. Okay, let's have a look what we've got. As we can see there, we shall focus. It says Matchbox Super Fast number 11, 1972, Lesney Flying Bug. Okay, two rivets, one at the front, one at the back, which I've already drilled out. So let's carefully take it apart. Let's see what we've got. Now we've got the funny man in there. His helmet there has come off. Interior just falls out, and then this, I would say, that just slides out like that. Well, there's the body, all ready for caustic soda boiling water. Put that there. That plastic thing there, we don't need. Um, his helmet, <laughs> don't need him. Uh, the windscreen, that's just brown plastic that you can't see through. Very grubby. So we'll have to clean all that up. And then all this part here, it's all connected to him. And there's two rivets there. So what I'm gonna have to do with that is drill them rivets out and then cut there, cut there so that I can put the suspension back. As you can see at the back there, oh, in shot. I'm gonna have to cut there, cut there, and then you can see all these wheels are wobbly, so there's something going on there. So, I'll carry on, I'll drill these out, and I'll get back to you. Catch you in later. Okay, there's a bit quick update on where we're up to. Um, the base, uh, the man here, he was there like that, so I cut him off. So I've still got the uh, suspension bars. Painted the base black, matte black. <coughs> and we did a wheel swap. Now them wheels came from a Hot Wheels fantasy car. Now the back wheels were the exact same diameter as what the old ones were. The front ones were one mil diameter larger. But the back wheels, they were narrower. So I had to make up some axle spaces. So what I used was the good old cotton, cotton stick, Q-tip, whatever you want to call them. I cut two at four mil and then slit them down the length and then just clicked them over the axles. Because these, these things are, are hollow inside. So they're quite a handy thing to have. So that's the base. Uh, the body. <coughs> 
stripped all the old paint off and cleaned up all the casting and then where the big hole was in the roof there I cut a piece of plastic to the size that I needed super glued it in position and a super glue and baking powder and then filled it all over with JB Weld um, this is the plastic I used and it was a lid from an ice cream container and also I put some windows in some clear windows these were the, this was the window section and I didn't like it because you can't see through so so I didn't use that so it's not 100% as you can see at the back there there's a little bit there but hey I'm happy with it so let's get it put together get it on the roundabout let's have a look what we've ended up with so I'll catch you then now here's just a quick look at what we started off with as we can see lots of paint missing um, one of the jet things on the roofs missing um, the wings are missing but it's a V-dub so let's have a look what we've ended up with okay this is what we've ended up with so what did we do well we stripped all the old paint off primer undercoat and that uh, colour is called medium grey we did a wheel swap with a Hot Wheels fantasy car detailed the front headlights front marker lights the door handles the back number plate the back brake lights filled in all the roof and put in some plastic window section they were from a, a food container so leave us a comment let us know what you think and I'd like to thank all my subscribers all my new subscribers all my old subscribers and if you're not a subscriber please consider being one hit that notification bell and you'll get notified as to my next video so that's it for another one stay safe everyone oh I did a black wash in that back grill there at the back so yeah stay safe everyone and I'll catch you next time bye for now